Now, just over a year ago, our friend and colleague Bill Turnbull died of prostate cancer. He was best known as a familiar face on the BBC Breakfast sofa for, what, 15 years. But he was also a dedicated Wickham Wanderers fan. Yeah, his dedication to Wickham knew, uh, knew few bounds, I think. Uh, today, some of Bill's family and friends are going to honour his legacy mm -hmm. by walking from Wembley to the home of his beloved team, to Adams Park, in aid of the charity Prostate Cancer UK. Yeah, and our reporter, Graeme Satchel, is in Wembley at the starting line. Uh, Graeme, uh, good morning uh, to you. And a famous uh, face with him as well. And, and, a, and a famous face indeed. Uh, tell us uh, what's going to happen today and, um, and what's the atmosphere like this morning. Morning to you guys. Yes, we are inside Wembley Stadium. I, I'm hugely honoured to be joined <laughs> by the sporting broadcasting legend, Jeff Stelling. And Jeff, you've been doing these uh, football marches for how long now? Well, this will be the 34th, I think, and um, it's been about seven years, something like that. So uh, a lot of miles have gone into these short legs. <laughs> Why do you do it? Well, look, you know, uh, when we first started to do it, um, prostate cancer, I'd never heard of it. I didn't... A lot of people called it prostrate cancer. Yes. No one had any awareness of it whatsoever. And we started the marches, really, to try and raise awareness of what prostate cancer was, how it affected men. One man in eight will be affected by prostate cancer. One in four if you're black. You know, I mean, it's a huge, huge issue, not just for men, of course, but for their families, for their wives, for their daughters, you know, their sisters yeah. and so on and, and so forth. We want to raise awareness. So we Hopefully we've, we've helped do that. We've raised a few quid on the way. One and a well. half million quid yeah, so far. I yeah, mean, incredible. Yeah. So, and today you're walking to Wickham. It, it's sort of in honour of Bill, isn't it? It is in honour of yeah. Bill, yeah. You know, I, I vowed that 33, the 33rd marathon was the last one. But Bill, I didn't know Bill that well, I'll be absolutely honest. But, you know, our lives followed sort of semi-parallel paths. We both started in local radio, um, we, we both moved to London, we both made our marks in different areas, we both supported smaller football yes. teams, shall we? So we were both aware of each other. And, and Bill was just such a legend, you know, and, you know, such a wonderful guy as well, that I thought, well, we'll get the boots out just for one more time. Well, Bill would be proud of you, though. Well done.